I've recently spotted this article on the BBC News website, The Hidden Landscapes the Heat Wave is Revealing. The best candidate for finding something similar in Worcestershire has to be Pershaw Abbey. If ever there was a drone mission, this was it. Pershaw Abbey was one of the largest medieval abbeys in Britain, larger even than Worcester Cathedral. The abbey survived until the Reformation and was one of the last major monasteries to be dissolved by Henry VIII. Most of the monastic buildings were pulled down and the stone sold off for building material. The abbey church would have followed, but the parishioners of Pershaw raised £400 to buy the monk's choir to serve as their parish church. The abbey we see today is only a small part of the original medieval building, so are any parts of that now showing because of the recent heatwave? Let's freeze frame here for a while. The abbey used to extend towards us as far as the gates you can see on the path. They mark the position of the original west door of the abbey. The first thing I notice is this rectangle. Can we match this with anything known about the abbey's history? Looking at the entry for Pershaw Abbey on Historic England provides us with a disappointingly small scale plan of the original extent of the buildings. The mark in the grass matches perfectly. These circles are very obvious, and the lower one is clearly visible at ground level as a depression in the ground. I suspect these are modern, and probably sites of tree planting in the past. This diagonal is obvious from 250 feet, but I can't match it with anything historical. This diagonal is very faded, or am I beginning to imagine things now? And finally, this fork is fairly clear, but I suspect it's probably the line of drainage or some other service. If you know or think differently, please get in touch or leave a comment if you're watching this on YouTube. The Mavic Pro is 200 feet up, so with one major success and a few possibilities in the can, just for the fun of it, let's have a look at Abbey Park. We'll end with an RTH. For drone muggles, that is a totally automated return to home, right back to the takeoff point. I just stand and watch, but I keep an eye on the drone's proximity to trees. Mm -hmm. 